Hey there guys, today I got a trailer coupler lock. I think I've done a master trailer coupler lock in the past, but it's probably been two years ago. If not, I will have to locate that lock and uh, put up a video for you guys. Uh, but this one is a Hermax uh, COR-75. Yeah, that's what it says on the lock body on both sides. And uh, it's used to lock out uh, trailer hitches, I believe. Yeah. And uh, here's a look. It's a six pinner. It doesn't have any security pins in it. Uh, here's a look at the key bidding, though. Yeah, that key's a little bent. Let's try this one. There we go. Got six pins in it. No security pins. Below the key says Hermex. On both sides, I believe. Hermax. Hermax, yeah. Uh, so there's a look at the key bidding. There's no uh, codes or anything like that on the lock. Or on the keys. A tension wrench in there. And I start at the back of the lock. Uh, for some reason, most trailer coupler locks have a very uh, smooth keyway and let's see here I just said it didn't have security pins in it and that kind of feels like a false set maybe I just didn't get all the pins picked uh, let's see here nope oh, I think I overset that one let's try this again here most of these locks I've handled one made in Thailand. It's very very smooth inside the keyway. Uh, this one is, and I believe that master that I had. Now it's giving me a fight. As soon as I turn on the camera, it starts fighting. But yeah, inside the keyway, normally these locks are very smooth. I don't know why. Um it doesn't seem to matter matter much make or manufacture uh, they just seem to be very smooth uh, locks and this one would normally just pop right open if I didn't have the camera on there we go that was a little bit embarrassing yeah, I was warming up for the video, man. I was just sticking my pick in. The lock would pop right open. Turn the camera on. Next thing you know, it wants to be a superhero. Yeah, so there it is. Picked open. And like I said, uh, there's no uh, security pins inside. I don't think that was a false set I was getting. Uh, I think the lock was just going to be uh, extremely difficult. Um, yeah. And uh, this one happens to be key retaining. I'm not sure how many of them are key retaining. I haven't really messed with a whole lot of these locks. Uh, I know uh, this style, there's a whole lot out there. Um, yeah, so you can get uh, some that have the shackle go out this way. And there's, you know, there's a uh, centerpiece here. Yeah, and then there's another shackle. Uh, I think you can get some that have a keyway over here and a keyway over here. You get all kinds of different designs. Um, take two chains, I guess, is, is one application for these locks. Um, Wizzwazzle did a video. Uh, I'm not sure if it was on the master trailer coupler lock or a copy. But uh, he used his half diamond as a stick knife. Either went up or down the back of the keyway and bypassed the lock. I tried my stick knife on this guy. I can't find a bypass for him. So when you get these, you may play around with them, like with a stick knife. Just poke around the keyway and uh, see if you can't get the lock just to pop open. So, as always, guys, thank you for watching all these videos. I really appreciate the views and I really appreciate the comments. So, thank you for taking time out of your day to have a look and see what I'm posting. I deeply appreciate it. And as always, you guys have a good one.